if you've been dreaming of migrating to Finland and you feel you don't have a necessary qualification or skill needed, there are still other ways you can migrate to Finland and they are free. This video is specifically for you. If you know you don't have any skill or you think you can afford to get the skill needed. Yes, of course, I know right now, most of all the learning platforms, Coursera, Udemy, and the likes of it, they are having sales. They've slashed the prices for their courses to enable you to get any skill you need. But if you think you might not be able to afford it, then you can go through another route, which is the vocational studies pathway. Today, I want to tell you and show you how you can go to Finland through the vocational studies pathway. Vocational studies now is a place where you're being trained of a particular skill to prepare you for the labor market. So you can be able to go out there and have something you can give, something you can sell yourself for. They have different courses, both for caterers, cleaners, engineers, software developers, business, tourism, whatever it is, whatever you're looking for, you can get it in the vocational studies. Now I want to show you how you can find any vocational study school in Finland. How you can apply to the courses, what you just need to do just for you to get admitted into the schools. They are free. Feel free to just make any application. But before we get into this guys, if you're coming across my videos for the first time, I want to say welcome to you. Just kindly hit the subscribe button so you just become a member of this family. And if you know you're benefiting something, you, you know the videos I've been putting out here is like encouraging you or putting you to your feet to be able to achieve this, your dreams of migrating abroad. Why don't you consider subscribing? Because on this channel, I create out content. I give you content that will enable you to achieve your dreams of migrating abroad. Either way, either you have the skill or you don't have the skill for qualified and unqualified people. For those with the skills and those without the skills, I make videos around all parts ways all levels even for students also how you can get scholarships also that is what i do on this video is my desire and my prayers that you all achieve your dreams of migrating abroad now finland there's a particular website where anything about studies whether you want to go for the masters for the brc or you're looking for vocational studies this particular website is going to show you everything it's going to put you through into everything guys when you hear vocational studies, it's a very good way for you to migrate to any country offering it, whether it's in Germany or in Finland. But today's one, I want to show you that, that of Finland. You should key into this. They give you any kind of skills, even software development, IT, tech, which is like something every country is looking for now. So guys, let me show you this particular website. What you need to do, how you need to go about it. Some of them might have been, might have closed as of now because some courses will start in this January. But of course, they're going to be opening again in spring. That is March, which is very close. In some cases, they're not going to put out dates of resumption, but they put out contact details there. Please go ahead and send them mails. If you have to call them, there, there's a, there are numbers there you can call. Pick the number and ask just to know when they're starting up their next admission process. So you'll be the first to know and know where to start your application. You don't have to wait. So when they are open, then, okay, the whole news will be on the internet and people are already applying. You don't want to be among the last or second. Just be among the first. That is why you have to just make the inquiries. Keep it to, keep it to yourself or share with those you want to share with. As soon as they start, you start your application immediately. Try and be among the first. Most of these things are done according to um, the reading basis of first come, first serve. So guys, let me show you this particular website and show you how you can go about it. Send mails to the contacts you will see there if you have to. If you want to be an engineer, you want to go through the cleaning pathway, or you want to be a chair, a chef, you want to cook, or you want to go through business, tourism management, whatever it is, these schools offer it. This particular website is going to show you all you need to know. So let's get into it, guys. But before we go, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family members. As you give it a thumbs up, it's been recommended to others also looking for ways to migrate abroad. So do me that favor by tapping on the like button there so you can recommend it to them. And then don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done that. And if you're a returning subscriber, I wanna say thank you very much. I love you so much. The encouragement I get from you all is the reason why I keep doing this. Thank you for being with me and sticking with me. And welcome to the new 
subscribers still joining the family i'll see you in my next video let's get into it so guys this is the website if you're looking to study in finland you want to make inquiries on everything about studying in finland whether you want to do your masters your bsc this is the website you have to come to study info even for vocational studies and you're already in a vocational studies trains you with skills you have a training in particular kind of skills that prepares you for the labor market gives you a skill that you that can help you get your dream job or land job you're looking for in any country even if it's not finland so when you talk about Finland, you have to go to the study info to see everything about, about vocational studies and how you can go about it. These vocational studies are free. You're not paying for anything. And like I said earlier, if you know you cannot afford paying for a skill, then you should look towards this particular pathway that is free and then taught in English also. Now, when you come into this particular website now, if you want, you can just go through and see. Here yeah, it said joint application to higher education. These are for masters and BSCs and all. The application is already ongoing from the 3rd of January to 17th of January 2024. This is for masters and BSCs. So but here we're going to the vocational studies side. You just come here and select upper secondary education, then select vocational education and training, VET. It brings you here. And then you can see here, they said a vocational qualification provides good capabilities for working life. Vocational studies in Finland can either lead to a qualification or be in the form of further education or continuous continuing education either in different career stages. There are three different types. You have the vocational upper secondary school qualification. This one is for the upper secondary school level. Like in my country, I know it's the technical colleges where they teach you painting, welding, mechanic all those stuff that is the upper secondary school level then they have the further vocational qualification that is if you already have a skill and here you can now maybe enhance it here and then they have the special special specialist vocational qualification in vocational education you can complete a full degree a qualification unit or a competence area vocational qualifications can be completed in school-based vet or as competence-based qualification See here, they said vocational education is mostly offered in Finnish and Swedish, but there are a few vocational qualifications offered in English. So I'll take you to the ones that are offered in English so you don't have to stress yourself. See here, vocational upper secondary qualification in Finnish gives you basic broad professional skills for various tasks within an industry. You will also gain skills for entrepreneurship and such knowledge and skill which are required for further study. The vocational upper secondary school qualification includes 180 competence points. Now, this is for the further vocational. If you want to go in for this, you can see is you already have a necessary professional skill in working life, which are deeper than the required for the vocational secondary school, secondary qualification. So let's go into for let's go in for this particular one. List of vocational upper secondary qualification available in English. You just click on it. This particular website are going to get all the schools that offer different courses for vocational studies. They're going to get everything here. So we will just you can see you can see here. I don't know what this means, but from here you can see. Okay, they just jump this. Let me take you to the other ones. You can come here. Anything you see and you know you cannot translate it. Let me put my just copy it and go to Google and put it in English. But mine is already in English. So you can see. I don't know. Perus too. I don't know what this is. Holders of a vocational qualification in food production. Okay, this is about food. Food production have the vocational skills required for working in the food production sector. They know how to conduct self-monitoring, observe good food hygiene, and ensure product safety. So this is for food production. And then we can go down and you can see for mechanical engineering and production technology or vocational studies. You can see vocational qualification for in business. The same thing here, here is for business work also. You can see. Then you can also come down, you see, for tourism industry, vocational qualification in clean and property. If you're looking towards migrating to the cleaning service, you should go through this so they can train you and then you can actually get a job there. 
vocational qualification for restaurants and catering services for chefs and all that. Vocational qualification in social and healthcare. Healthcare service, you know, when you're looking for care certificate and you cannot afford it, pick this is for free. Most of these schools are already closed, and then they are certain they are they are learning by this January. But for spring, which is going to be from March, April, May, they will start up again. So just save this website and then ensure you come back to it. Here, as see holders of vocational qualification information and communication. This is for IT. Let me just take you into it and show you what it entails. See, you can see here, welfare technology installer, that's the qualification titles, electronic assembler, network installer, IT support specialist, software developer. You can see level four, European level of education and all. 180 competence points and it's free. These, all these are free guys. They are currently, okay, there are about three schools that are offering the business college, another one in Omnia, and the other one, okay, these schools, these two schools are the ones offering this particular course. You can see here, they said free of charge is in Helsinki. Just go ahead and click on this. You can check any of the schools and know which one you want to go for. But let me just pick a particular one and show you. And when you click on it, when it opens, you can see here the duration is one year, five months. Daytime teaching free of charge. Contact teaching meaning you have to be present in Finland. That is sponsorship, you know, taking you to Finland now to go study. Now, for this one, you can see they're not showing if it's ongoing or not. That is because they might not be open at the moment. But all you need to do is just this contact person send a mail to this place or you call this number just to find out when they are starting the admission process again information is one thing that takes you far away find out when they are starting and then write, just keep it when they tell you keep it and then get ready and prepare yourselves you want all you need to, all you need for this just prepare it now you don't need the Finnish language you know that you can just go ahead with english because it's going to be in english you can also check this school here but let me show you another one before we go off. Check the score and know when they're starting also. Then let's look at... Let's look at the business. Qualification holders have competence in customer-oriented business. Businesses. You can see here too. Level four, European level four. And then these are the schools that are going to be offering it. Osas, O, Omenia, Trendu, Business College, Helsinki. Then you click on Business College, Helsinki. It's still very free, daytime teaching. It brings you to the school. You see, they did not write when it's when they're starting their admission. So just send the mail to this particular email address or call them to ask when they are starting admission. Be the first to know. Keep yourself abreast with information. So you'll be the first person or the first people to do the application because of course they will be attending to people according to when they came or when they did the application. So guys, save this particular website on your laptop or your phone or whatever and always go back to it to find out everything about vocational studies in Finland. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and then turn on your notification bell so you don't miss out on any video I'll be uploading. If this is your first time, I want to say welcome to the family. Please just hit the subscription button there. And then if it's the second time you're, you're just coming back, returning subscribe, I want to say thank you very much. And I hope to see you again in my next video. Take good care of yourselves. See you all next time and good luck as you do your applications. Bye.